Amy Schumer under fire. The comedian slammed for what some are saying is a racially insensitive parody. It all started after she released an all-star video tribute to Beyonce. Tracking at number one, Amy's formation fallout. I hate us corny with that Illuminati mess. I just want to say... I'm grateful. My daddy Alabama, mama Louisiana. I'm grateful to be alive right now. During this time. I hope you have a good night too. With that early morning Instagram message making no mention of the social media fallout from her formation tribute, on Twitter the hashtag Amy Schumer gotta go party rages on. Amy, you're directing this, right? I'm going to be your assistant? Yes, you're my assistant. Okay, cool. <laughs> the parody, which was filmed in Hawaii, where Amy just shot her upcoming comedy Mother Daughter, also features co-stars Goldie Hawn, Wanda Sykes, and friend Joan Cusack. We should film at the porta potty Here coming, coming out of the porta potty Just like shots of us hanging outside the bathroom. Accused of cultural appropriation and being culturally tone deaf for using toilet humor like that to represent Beyonce's political anthem, Twitter was not happy. One person tweeted, quote, It is weird to me that Amy Schumer thought a song about the police killing black people was perfect for a parody. Can someone just go out and get me a lemonade? But parodying lemonade is nothing new. James Corden served us Lemon James. They don't love you like I love you. And just last week, SNL unleashed a Trump sized portion of Melania Nate. I'm not sorry. I'm not sorry. Melania was funny. This was more poking fun about things that you probably shouldn't poke fun at about race. Our cultural insider at Los Angeles Daily News, Anita Bennett, explains why Amy's take on formation has struck such a nerve. I would not say Amy Schumer had ill intentions, but I would say she's tone deaf in this instance. I mean, this song, Beyonce's Formation, it's a very powerful song. It's about race in America. You mix that Negro with that Creole, make a Texas Bama. The t-shirts that said Texas Bama, like that phrase has racial undertones. It has a deep history for African Americans. To make a parody about this, again, I just have to ask, what, what were you thinking? What do you just think about all the social media response that people can have, two bits, good or bad? I think it's people's right now they have the tools to let a comedian know right away what they think about it and then what you do with that is 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 up to you if you think it's funny you should you should say it and not and not apologize for it sticking to her own philosophy amy is standing by her work and it seems to have the blessing of the carters considering the parody was first released on title which is co-owned by jay-z amy posted this nearly nude portrait on instagram with the caption quote Thanks for the exclusive release title. We had so much fun making this tribute. All love and women inspiring each other. Always stay gracious. Best revenge is your paper.